Hello bros, Duraludon strikes again. Someone requested to play Duraludon, and here it is. I hope you enjoy it and learn something. Please give a like to the video if you want to help this channel grow. Anyways, Duraludon is really hard to play in solo queue. It's not just a 5-man attacker's game. It also really needs well-coordinated teammates, especially a defender to protect you. But these tips will help you win games using this Pokemon. Tips. Duraludon is not a bad laner. It can fight and secure objectives. For me, it's good if someone invades your farms. Try to focus the damage on the enemy first because it deals a lot of damage, especially when using laser focus. Choose either to use Flash Cannon or Dragon Pulse in the game. I didn't choose Dragon Pulse because the enemy team is good against close range combat, and Dragon Pulse requires moving forward, which is risky against this enemy team. I use Flash Cannon so that I can distance myself and deal a lot of damage in the back line only. Use your flash cannon in the bush. Really try your best to use it at a distance, and the bush is your ultimate friend when running this build. Dragon Pulse is excellent against reaping, that's the advantage of that. Use your Unite move to hit Rayquaza and Fast Flip, and you will win the game. But if you're running Dragon Pulse, Focus Band is really required, because you're prone to damage. In this game with Wigglytuff and Blastoise, it's an invalidating move, to be honest. That's why I use flash cannon so that I can deal damage and make them move back acting like a defensive barrier to the team so that they can't overcommit to the situation or team fights. Don't forget to like and subscribe, bros. Thank you. And stay hydrated as always.
Oh, <laughs> 